can I be a Jew? You really want this? Sincerely. Not because this one's trying to blackmail me for something stupid when I was 19, or for broccoli with your dinner. What is this for you? Honestly. I think I found my people. I was raised in a church where I was told to believe and pray. And if I was bad, I'd go to hell. If I was good, I'd go to heaven. And if I'd ask Jesus, he'd forgive me, and that was that. And here y'all saying, ain't no hell. Ain't sure about heaven. And if you do something wrong, you got to figure it out yourself. And as far as God's concerned, it's your job to keep asking questions and to keep learning and to keep arguing. It's like a verb. It's like you do God. And that's a lot of work. But I think I'm in, at least as far as I can see it. I mean, maybe I'll learn more. And say, Fuck the whole thing. I mean, but I want to learn more, and I think I got to be in it to do that. You know, does that make sense? Shit, did I just talk myself out of it? Ask me again. Can I be a Jew? Yes. No, I need three answers. Yes. Yes. Yeah! <laughs> Look at me now, I'm a bona fide Jew. <laughs> sort of. It's not really official without the mikvah, but that was wonderful. Really, Tova, congratulations. Oh, Mik what? Oh, it's like, um, it's like a, a baptism, but without all the touching. You soak in a pool and you... Mm -hmm. Clean off all that Christian filth that you've been carrying around. <laughs> we can fake that shit in the shower. No, that won't count. The mikvah needs to be pure, naturally occurring water, and you need to be fully submerged and nude. Yeah. Maybe it'll rain, okay? We can just, there'll be a sinkhole or something. And we'll make it official then. In the meantime, you are Jewish, huh? 